Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, please don't forget to like, subscribe, and share with your friends. And today is pin 4 of 5 edition, you guys. So as some of you know, I bought a pack of 50 pins and I divided them into 10 um, different, well, in 5 se sessions of 10 pins. So the video wouldn't be too long and today I am doing the pin edition number four so let's get to this. If you do know what type of pin it is and I do have the name wrong or I have the character or where the movie is from please feel free to leave the comments below. I love to hear from you guys and if you want to see some more of these videos leave a comment also. So the first one that we're going to start with is Piglet. And it looks sort of like the little pins that they put back in the days on the little diapers for the kids. Some of you might be too young <laughs> to know these, but I remember when they used to do the cloth diapers and they had the little special pins. That's what it reminds me of, but it's so cute. The little piglet. And this one, I always confuse it. I don't know if this is from the Tower of Terror. Or if this is from Haunted Mansion, although Haunted Mansion is kind of black and white versus Tower of Terror. I think it might be more Tower of Terror, Mickey. Either way, it's beautiful. I like the quality of them. Don't think that because you're buying stuff on eBay that the quality might be bad. Because that was one of my concerns, but I my expectation was not high for these um, pins because they were used. I am fully aware that they're used. Some of them are special editions. I love this one. This one looks very old, like the old characters of Mickey. I don't know if this is a limited edition. This is just a hidden Mickey pen. It's 5 of 10. So, I was a little concerned to see maybe if, um, like the condition of them, maybe they were going to be too, um, Use, but no, this person took very good care of their pin. So, here's another one. Again, you guys, I'm sorry if I don't know what it's supposed to represent. I apologize for that. But feel free to let me know in the comments below, okay? And this one, I'm guessing it's Donald. It's so cute. I like the quality of these pins. And if you just heard that door, that was one of my neighbors, so sorry about that. And this one. How pretty is that one? I like this. This one's real pretty. At first I thought this had to do with Beauty and the Beast, right? But there's like a little bear on there, so I've never really noticed if this is from Beauty and the Beast or Dumbo. I'm not quite sure. I know that a lot of these pins are very old because I, when I looked at, um, in the back of them, there's writing, right? And some of them show the year. So I'm not quite sure if it's, you know, related to one or the other. They're beautiful regardless, so it really doesn't matter to me. And I can finally say I have something from Star Wars, you guys, that I, I don't really particularly need here for Star Wars, so I'm not against it, but I have no idea what this is, so please <laughs> leave it in the comments below. This other one, this one is beautiful, but I have no idea what it represents. I don't know what it's supposed to be about, so, but I love that it's blue. It's that beautiful navy blue color. And then we have two more to go, and this one is really nice also. The cutout of Mickey. This one's really, really nice. I like this one. And then the final one that I have is for China. Represents China. So, as you can tell by the video, hopefully the video is doing it justice. I'll make sure to take pictures. Um, of the pen um, to show you but as you can see they're in great condition like to, for them to be used 
um, they were pretty much, I would say, used lightly. There was only one pin from the first pin edition. There was a little bit more used than the other ones, but, you know, that pin was from 2005, I believe. So, it is to be expected. It was used. It's probably traded. And that's the whole thing about it. Like, I don't know in where and what Disney um theme park it was traded in and what year, how, you know, it could have been traded around the world and came right back. Like we don't even know. So that's like the magic about it. It's a mysterious thing that you don't know if they've been to Shanghai Disney because I did have some. Um, they said Shanghai or some of them that said China. Um, so it's intriguing to see what travel um, these pins have taken, like, you know, in the little bit of time. So definitely, you guys, if you like this video, like, subscribe, share with your friends. Don't forget to hit the notification box. And I will see you guys for edition number five. Bye.